Hi everyone and welcome to this short tutorial where I'm going to show you how you can download Envoy from FDroid. FDroid is an installable catalogue of free and open source software applications for the Android platform. The client makes it easy to browse, install and keep track of updates on your device. FDroid comes pre-installed on the two most popular Android alternatives, Graphene OS and Calyx OS, but can also be easily installed on any standard Android operating system too. FDroid is a great alternative for individuals that want that typical App Store experience without the requirement of a Google account and its associated privacy trade-offs. Here at Foundation, we maintain our own FDroid repository that can be easily added to your FDroid app so that you can download Envoy without Google and also keep the app up to speed with the latest updates. To download FDroid onto your phone, simply open a web browser, visit f-droid.org and tap the download button. Assuming that you now have FDroid installed on your phone, let's get started. So I've got a web browser open here and I'm just gonna head over to foundationdevices.com slash FDroid. And that's gonna bring up the information that we need to add into our FDroid application so that we can download Envoy. So three really simple instructions. First one is copy the link. I'm going to tap and hold and copy that link address. Then I'm going to open the FDroid application. This is what the home screen looks like. From here, I'm going to head to settings, tap on repositories, and then tap on the plus in the top right hand corner. Now, because we copy that link over on our web browser, FDroid has automatically detected all of the information that we need and populated it into the relevant boxes. So all we need to do is tap add. As you can see at the bottom now, we have the foundation devices FDroid repository. When it's initially added, it will say unverified, but after a brief wait, that warning will disappear. So the next step is to go back to the FDroid home screen. We can swipe down to refresh all of the repositories. And then after we've refreshed, we can just search for Envoy. And there we go. There's Envoy. And we can just tap the install button as you would with a typical Play Store. That's it. Super simple. Envoy is now installed via FDroid. And we can open the app and you'll be met with the familiar welcome screen. Now that we have Envoy installed via the FDroid repository, anytime that the foundation developer team push an update to the FDroid repository, you'll be notified that there's an update available for Envoy as you would with any typical application store. And it's just one tap to update the application. To remove the foundation FDroid repository from your application is essentially the reverse of what we've just done. So head to settings, tap on repositories, locate the repository that you want to remove and then you can tap trash can in the top right hand corner and then tap delete. 